Okay, joined by Martha O'Donoghue from Bally Bowden St. Enders here at Parnell Park ahead of the Go Ahead Ireland uh, Senior 1 Camogie final against uh, St. Vincent's this Friday evening here at Parnell Park. And uh, Martha, I'm sure plenty of excitement uh, at the moment uh, over the past few weeks heading into this uh, county final. Yeah, we're really looking forward to it. Um, it's been 10 years since we've been there before, so the preparation's going well. We're really looking forward to it, yeah. Yeah, like I say, it's been 10 years since uh, your last county final appearance and obviously 10 years since your last county final uh, win. It's been a long wait, I guess. You were involved in the, I think, three county final wins in a row previous to, up to up to 2014. So you have experience in terms of county finals, but I'm sure uh, you're looking forward to kind of closing that gap, any of that gap and any of that wait for a county final win uh, this weekend. Yeah, it's been a, a decade since we've been there before and a completely different team, a bunch of girls to go forward to it at the final. So we're really looking forward to it. And yeah, it's all to play for now. It's great. Obviously, uh, you got through a uh, semi-final against Jude's by a point. A uh, very tight encounter there. Jude's obviously one of the formidable sides in, in Dublin over the past number of years. Uh, how do you assess your campaign overall heading into the final? Um, yeah, we had some really tough group games. Um, we had Vincent's in the group stages and then to play Jude's away to Jude's was, we knew it was going to be a really tough battle getting there, but a sweet victory by a point. A really, really tough battle. Matchups were good and We'd been there the previous year in the exact same position and we knew we did not want to leave Time in the Park with another loss. So we got over the we got over the line and we're exactly where we need to be and where we want to be now this coming Friday. Um, it is St. Vincent's in the final. You obviously, as you mentioned there, you played them earlier on in the campaign. Uh, what sort of challenge can you expect from them? Because they're, they're obviously going for three in a row. So they're, they know what they're about, I guess, from, from uh, over the past few years in terms of uh, county final appearances and county final wins. What can you expect from them uh, this weekend? Yeah, their experience is immense. And I suppose they know exactly what they need to do. And they've been here before us. So and we haven't been here in 10 years. But... Um, we will we'll have done our homework and we'll we'll be confident going into it hopefully now. So obviously it's going to be a really tough battle um, and we lost them by two points in the group stages. So um, again, we're looking forward to the week ahead and yeah, giving it a good lash. And finally, I guess a word on the support, how important that will be because St. Vincent's is just over the road, obviously. So they'll be getting a big support here on County Final Day on Friday. How important it would be to get a big Bally Bowden support out here on County Final Day on Friday as well to maybe give you that extra 1% or 2% that you'll need to, to get over the line. Yeah, we'll need that 16th player coming across uh, the M50, so hopefully we'll get a bunch of underage girls out and support from our families and our friends, and social media is always great, so we're going to be putting it out there, and we'll need all the support that we can get to get over the line.